All right, we're gonna go ahead and check out my new bait bucket, live well setup, and the aerator. Coming up next. All right, let's go ahead and check out my new bait bucket live well set up and my new aerator. This is the Fraybill drainer bait bucket. This is a two gallon bucket set up. It's salt water and fresh water tested. Uh, this, this drainer system uh, keeps your hands drier with I pull out inner minnow trap. So you can see it holds minnows or your bait of choice and also worms. So either night crawlers or your red worms. Uh, up here on top is where you would keep your worms. See inside here you got the drainage holes. So when you uh, get this flop back over, so when you pull this first bucket up, see how it drains the water out and you can pull your minnows out without getting your hands all wet. So it's a two bucket setup. And when you sit it back down, your water comes back in. Got a little slot to put your bait net. And over here you could clip on your aerator if you want it. But with clipping it here, when you pull up on this bucket, now watch that. It's fine when you pull up. But when you go back down, see how it hits? It wants to go into the bucket. So Instead of having to keep messing with that, there's a little slot on this side. You just gotta pull your hose a little bit so it's not a tight, kinda give it a little play. So when you pull up on this, it don't interfere with your aerator. Let's go ahead and talk about the aerator. All right, I went with the Baby Bubblers portable air pump. This is uh, made by Marina Metal Products. This is a keep unit dry. Uh, it's got a pretty sealed up, keep your battery from getting water in it. Uh, do up to a three gallon bucket. Takes a one double A battery. And you get a 24 inch air hose. And uh, air stone. This one doesn't have the insulated liner. But I like that because I've had the insulated ones. They work great. I was happy with it. But over time the insulation styrofoam does not hold up. And you got to pull it out. You still have the bucket but... Um, with this, don't have to worry about it. In winter time, a lot of times you don't need the insulation. Uh, during the summertime, that's when it's mainly important, and I just put a little piece of ice in there and keeps the water cool. Let's go ahead and turn it on. You just barely hear it running, very quiet. Very quiet. So that's it. 
All right, this completes the video. Everything will be in the description. You can check each item out if you're interested in that. Uh, this setup is going to work out great now that we're in winter, getting that cool weather. So you don't really want to stick your hand in cold water. So the drainer part of this bucket is going to work out great. I can pull it out, get my bait out without getting my hands all wet and damp. So I won't be using the, the net probably so much now. So I uh, hope this helps you guys out if you're looking for a nice little setup. Um, going to be using it very soon. Uh, hope everyone's having a good one. I'll see you guys in the next video.